The circuit below is operated for five minutes and calculate the energy transferred by the lamp. So we have a series circuit. There's the circuit loop. Here's our power supply. We have an ammeter which is measuring two amps flowing in this circuit and across the lamp we have a voltmeter which is measuring a potential difference of 12 volts. We've also got a resistor in this circuit but that's not playing any part in the calculation. So to start with we need to do a data list. So what do we know? Well we know that the time that this circuit is operated for is five minutes but a minute is not a standard unit so we need to convert that to seconds so there are 60 seconds in every minute so therefore times up by 60 and we get 300 seconds what else do we know in this series circuit we know the current I is 2 amps we also know that the potential difference or the voltage drop across the lamp is 12 volts and the question is asking us for the energy transferred and that will come out in joules because we're using standard units of volts, amps and seconds. So what equation links all of these quantities together? So the equation we're going to use is E equals VIT or EVIT, which is quite a good way of remembering it. Where does this equation come from? Well, it comes from two other equations, which I'm sure you're familiar with. The first equation it comes from is that power is equal to voltage times by current. And the second uh, equation it comes from is that energy is equal to power times by time. And if you put power equals voltage times current into where the P is here, we get EVIT. So that's where this equation comes from. It's quite a useful one to remember anyway. So that's the second stage in the calculation. First stage was to list the data. Second stage is to quote the equation. Third stage is solve, is to put the numbers in. Here we go. E equals 12 multiplied by 2 multiplied by the time which is 300 seconds and so E is equal to 7200 joules and that last stage is to state the answer with the correct unit which is joules and so that's the energy transferred by the power source to the lamp and transferring it to heat and light 7200 joules using the equation EVIT.